thank you very much, Marcel. Yes, when I uh, entered the European Parliament in 2014, what we were trying to achieve was to make the copyright better. Now we are fighting to make sure it doesn't get worse. So clearly the next European Parliament will have a huge task to actually do the copyright reform that we need and that Europe deserves. I would now like to welcome Matthias Bjarnemalm, the lead candidate of the Swedish Pirate Party. Hi, thank you. So my name is Matthias Bjarnemalm, but I'm normally called MOB because it's much shorter. And I'm the front runner of the Swedish Pirate Party, the first Pirate Party to be founded. And that's uh, a big responsibility to, to put on your shoulders. But I'm, I'm confident that we will do a great comeback in this election and reclaim our seats in the European Parliament. The Swedish Pirate Party was founded and the pirate movement was founded to defend digital rights online. We've grown from that, but that is our uh, foundation, our core. And there's no time that there's no time that that mission is more important than right now. The copyright directive is one example of how legislation is going towards censorship online, but it's not the only one. Article 13 will impose censorship machines by putting that in the hands of private companies. We have another directive that terrorist content online directive that will do a similar task for uh, forcing companies platforms to remove things that are flagged as terrorist content without a clear definition of terrorist content and without um, a legal procedure and this is two examples there will be more there is a trend towards trying to narrow down the free space that is the internet and we cannot let, let that happen the internet is the fundamental struggle. Every political struggle today is happening online. If you want to work for climate change, if you want to work for workers' rights, where, whatever you want to do, you're doing it online. That is the platform that we need um, for any societal change. And if that platform is restricted, where the freedom of speech is restricted and it's put in the hands of a few monopolies, then we will no longer have the space we need to fight for a better society. And that is why the pirates are needed to be there and stand up for the free and open internet. And I'm very thrilled for the chance of doing that with so many pirates from so many countries. Thank you.